Good morning, everybody, especially people in Vietnam. Yes, I am twitching and the living and mixing and YouTubing again. I am streaming. I am streaming. I am streaming. I tried to play in the PGO Tour last year, or yesterday, and I couldn't win a single game with the mouse and the keyboard. I still am functioning with my fake Microsoft controller called, made in China, called a PC controller play I mean yes it's cheaper it maps the keys a little differently but it seems to be for example even though I do have a mapping software it's deciding to ignore my mapping software Yeah, 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 see, it's going to embarrass me again, to all my new people watching the show. Yes, I did not make the cut. Yes, I was fucking terrible. Yes, I'll try again. I just have to win three events in a single season to instantly advance to the PGA Tour. Finish top 75 in earnings and I qualify for the Webcom Tour Championship. Alright. I'm gonna go with Easy again. I don't mind a little bit of challenge. This is the Webcom Tour opener. <coughs> and I'm ready to roll. I'm ready to rock. I'm ready to roll. And I'm ready to try some different. Hello and welcome to our coverage of the Web.com Tour opener. My name is Luke Elby, and with me is John McCarthy. Okay, so... Uh, Thanks for that intro, and uh, glad to be with you. Let's talk about this now. Our next golfer on the tee, it's their first Web.com Tour event. Have you got any insight as to what might be going through their head right now? Well, this is their first taste of competition at this high level. They'd be riddled with nerves. High level. With any luck, the Web.com Tour will be their ticket to the big time. High level. PGA Tour. All right. Thanks a lot, Luke. So we'll I'll talk just, to you later on. I'll show you. I, sh uh, I, I now have to use the D-pad in this particular keypad. But watch the stroke outcome. Look at that. A little bit fast on the front. There we go. I'm just watching. Just watching the shoulders. The shoulders of the animation. And all the shots are always straight. Now, having said that, of course, it'll probably fuck up. Oh, no, that's pretty good. Not bad. I stuck with the five wood because I wasn't quite sure. And I am pretty sure what a straight like shot would do. Hundred yards to the pin from here. There's no wind. There's no wind. No wind at all. No wind to speak of. No wind at all. The one thing I can't do with this option, of course, is for some odd reason. Oh, well now the map's working, but the left controller button does not work. So to 
change a lie for me, I have to go across, assign a controller, change it to the ma to the mouse and keyboard, where I change the loft, give it a bit of extra high loft. Go back, reassign the controller back to my, and then take the stroke. Uh, a little bit on the left there. What's going the off? This is going towards the rough here, folks. And uh, not the intended result, I'm sure, on that approach shot. Not no, enough wasn't. club on that one. Well, no, there was enough club, just not enough to right to. Not enough thingy, Bobby. Too much lift. All right, so my sandwich will take me actually. Let's go gap wedge because it is also going down a hill by the looks of it. And I hit it too hard again. Fourteen feet away. Patting wise though. Oh you div 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 divis. You got and to this one for bogey. You got to look. Oh, that was that was very close. And this part is for the double bogey. Double bogey, oh my god. What a start. Start with a new controller, keys, and I'm fucked and up already. The day off at two over. You know, I, I practiced putt after putt yesterday. And now let's move to the second hole. Let's not. What have I got? Driver. No wind. To speak of, still going off to the right, uh, left, sorry, because I fast struck it, struck it a bit too fast. I can't see him being uh, very happy about that. I struck it too fast. Okay, so I'm in rough. Rough will reduce my shot by 80%. So, if I'm hitting with a carry of 54 meters, I take away 20%. In this case, 12. Okay, ooh, now, this is interesting. Heavy rough with a 9 iron, it's only 80%. So, 10% is 7. 7 8 is 56. Roughly. Just got to get the swing right. Uh, and I've gone a bit too much to the right with a slow hand approach. And I've screwed it up again. But. If you're watching at home. And you're thinking, why are all his putts so damn straight? Or the shots so damn straight? I don't know. Nine meter carry. Alright, so that, that that's nine meters up there. Hit it too hard. Yeah, this putt to save par. Hello, par. Hello, Ma. How are you? Alright, again, this part up there is 36 meters. You can see the top right hand corner up here, where it says green 100%. 36 meters with this putter. I only am putting 3 meters. So, 
what I really want to do is not take it up too much at all I didn't take it up enough this one's about two feet from the cup okay so my new technique isn't sitting at plus three for the day after that hole isn't as successful as I thought it would be it's not winning any any rounds and now the third hole to you I have tried with the Microsoft controller that allows me to use because for some some strange reason I, I it won't use this if I go to left it will you work on this one but I noticed that even when I go to um, left and right with those they're not exactly not exactly correct Alright, let's let's have a break the swing. Watching the shoulder, that's what I'm gonna do. Watching the shoulder as I bring it up. Too much. Apparently too slow. Too slow again. Bit better. Uh, too fast on the bump swing, the back swing. Too slow on the forward swing. Very slow. I don't understand this. Ah. All right. So I'm. Um, There it is. Okay. Oh, I thought I, uh, I unhooked it. Oh, it's gonna go slicey poo. Real life coming back to haunt me. Yeah, this shot he's taken through the branches and can't be very pleased with himself after that. Why would I be pleased, Jack? Why would anyone be pleased after that? Oh, Jesus. We're looking for some serious trouble with this shot. And this one's going straight towards that water. Blog. Blog. Oh, Jesus. I want to restart. I want to I want to go somewhere else. I want to hide. I want to hide. And he is deep into the rough for his next shot here, folks. How deep is your rough? How deep is your rough, baby? How deep is your rough? Okay, 60%. That's about 80. About 90. And no, oh, I'm nowhere near that. Go again. Uh, go again, again. That's that's not good. That's not good at all. No good, no good. That's the best I could do. Try to hit it over there. Oh, 
I'll stay on the gray fair way for kicks. Hitting out of that lie, uh, still in the rough though. Okay, if anyone wants to chat and say hi, I will say hi back. Um, if anyone wants to tell me I'm an idiot, I will say I'm an idiot to myself back. I'm that kind of guy. I'm pleasing. I'm a pleaser. I'm a crowd pleaser. I'm a cheesemaker. Blessed are the cheesemakers. 34 meter carry. And it's going to flop. And it's gone to... Oh, okay, because the 9-iron... The 9-iron isn't very good. And floppies. No, no, it isn't very good at floppies. Where is it? It's gone. There it is. Pot. Are you joking? Are you joking me? change the shot so gotta change the shot baby okay I'm gonna go for a pitch Not a full pitch. I won't go for the full pitch. Still went for the full pitch. 90% power and still went overpowered. Mm. And 35 feet to go. Could might as well be 300 million trillion feet to go. 10 meters. Oh, look how short I am. I'm the Napoleon Bonaparte of Patius. And about 14 feet away here. And now, and now, Ooh, and, uh, just and, doesn't and, want to throw. and now, I decided to grow some and feet. And for triple. Triple. Which is okay if you're having a cake. Ooh, Chocolate layered cake. Triples good. And Hamburger good triple good. Quadruple bogey. Quadruple. It's like a bypass only. And as we yum look yum. at the leaderboard, our current leader today is sitting at one under. That's the score to beat. This is this is and supposed to be my game changer. Par three. Using this control methodology was supposed to be the way that I'm going to get in. But the only thing I've gotten into is absolute nothing. Hundred and twenty six meter carry Excuse me when I go to the very slow the top there. Almost all orange as much as very fast. I should also be worried about the two meter drop, but 
line, Iron. And there I go yeah, with the hooky. Might, uh, might have a bit too much club. Hooky, hooky on the feeling. And as it turns out, that's uh, safely on the green. And this putt is for birdie. Eleven meters. Right Boing. into the cup. Boing. Very, very nicely done. And he's moving in the right direction. That's how I was practicing. After that hole. And listen, folks, he's he's gotta like that. Okay, this let's is see not what practice. The has in store today. Let's not. We all know what the fifth has. It's a par five, par excellence. And just launched this drive. I launched it. I launch it to the left, and I launch it to the right. I launch it to the middle, and everything's all right. Yes, I launched it. This and about 170 yards to the pin. This is the beauty, because the the arrow is cut like the white line is as straight as a. Well, I was gonna say straight as an arrow, but it is an arrow. So, you know what I mean. I mean that's what I mean. I mean Jim Beam. Mmm, mmm, there's a 5% loss or 4% loss on the thingy, so that should be alright, considering. Going with the five and a here. little hooky, a little hook, and I think hello uh, beach, shot the green. hello beach, hello beach. And I don't think that was the intended result for that approach shot, too much club. <sighs> From here, it's about ten feet away. You know what they say? Ten feet away. Ooh, inches, inches away. No, another ten feet away. And this putt is for par. Inches away. Oh, I just... Oh. At least it's a little close to the hole. Yeah, and this putt is for bogey. Yeah, hello, bogey. Lunch so like bogey and Bacall. At the leaderboard now. Oh, I got four viewers watching me be a disastrous disaster. And now setting up for the next par four hole. Okay, come on, come on, come on. You're three wooding me, but I really need to go the driver. I need to go the driver. I need to go to way. I need to go to the driver and push it in a day. Perfect. I don't think we'll find some fairway here. Perfect. So why can't I do this with the short irons? Anyone know? It's almost perfect here. Look at that approach shot. Look at that gentlemen's and gentle women's. For the birdie. And not so gentle people's. Has it got enough? Has it got enough? And the answer is not. This is a disaster. And after that hole, I am sitting 
At seven over par. Yeah, seven over par, seven over ma, seven okay, over everything. Let's see what the seventh has in store. Still, I'm amazed at how straight the strokes are. The white line and the little blue thing. So, that's a plus, right? It's got to be a plus. When the wind starts picking up at the few of the later games, it might be an advantageous. But you gotta get that swing right. That's short on the uh, the white line there. Still, 250 meters. And he's probably gonna like that. I have no idea why the white line went short. 76 meter carry. With the bounce. It's pitching, eh? Going with the eight iron. Eight iron. That's looking pretty good. Eight iron. As in the irony. Eight the iron. iron. The putter's coming iron. Out now. This one's about ten feet from the cup. Oh, I completed a, a challenge. Long drive. Looks pretty straight. Now. Can I hit the pace? Missing here. And about four feet from the cup. This game is so frustrating. And that putt will drop for par. Yeah, he, he, he congratulates so himself for getting a friggin' par. par. Okay, we find ourselves now in the eighth hole tee off. That's par three. Okay, even I can see that. Eight iron. Nine iron uh, might be trouble. There's no wind. I might. I know what I'll do. I'll. Uh, I'll use my mouse to reassign my controller to mouse and controller. And then just increase a little bit of the loft. And then reassign the controller again. Back to my joystick gamepad thingy. an 8 iron. Oh my! I just love the sound of a golf shot smacking that pin. There is nothing like it. Nothing wrong with that. Yes, there About is. 15 feet to the cup from here. That's what was wrong with it. It led the 15 feet to the cup. Par. Finishing this hole with a solid putt. And after that, seven over par for the day. It's very annoying. And now setting up for the par four. Very, very annoying. I, sh I should win this one. I should win this one for the Gipper. Although I don't know who the fuck the Gipper really is. But it works well with my American followers, so win one with the Gipper. Little, little hooky hooky. Stay out of the water. Bring your swimmers. And let's see if he re-hits or takes the drop. He's definitely in the water, though. Bring your swimmers. Bring and out your dead. About 30 yards to the pin. For fuck's sake. 
How frustrating is this game? Going with the pitching wedge here. How frustrating is this game? And this is to save par. This shot is looking too good. And just missing the par that uh, would have been nice to have. And now let's uh, take a look and see what's happening up on that leaderboard. No, as we let's transition not. into the back nine here in our final round of action. Luke, I'm curious as to what you're seeing on the course today. Fucking disaster. We've seen the for an incredible comeback. Seven shots is not an impossible task. It's getting oh, pretty close to it. Stop for that, Luke. Stop playing with your dick. Seriously, man. Incredible comeback. Stop playing with your dick. There's a little hook in the trees. Oh, looks like he's going through the branches here. My goodness, my goodness, goodness me. Oh my goodness, goodness, my goodness, goodness me. I need to lift the chair up because I'm going to die in place. This chair is crap. Not that it's affecting my game. My game is crap all on its own. All on its own. Absolute okay, garbage. Green is within reach. That's uh Seven iron is the last iron you can chip with. Oh my word. And cutting straight to the point here, folks. Right at that pin. Nice shot. About 13 feet away. Stop telling me it's a nice shot because I know it's not. And the power pup will drop. I needed that. And after that hole, he is moving up on the leaderboard. Because okay, tied for 60 is really, really good. Being tied for 60th position, it's a noble gesture. Really, really great work on my part. And that's uh, taking a nice slice of pie. No. Unfortunately, yes. he's ended up in the water here. Yes, of course. Of course, it's going to end up in the water, because that is my luck. That's not where I, it should. It should have allowed me. It landed on the scum of a bitch. Scum of a bitch. Scum of a bitch. Don't go out the other end for God's sake. From twenty two feet out. This one for Bogey. Suddenly, after that one who has gone down in the standings. 
And yeah. Yeah, he's not going to like that. Yeah, I'm not. Okay, moving on to the 12th. Normally I don't do water. Look, water, water is for wet people. Or deep ones. But not for golfers. Water's not for golfers. Oh, look at that lovely slice. I'm going to get some more water. Shit. I can't. I just can't. I just can't. I don't understand. Well, I do understand. I'm crap. I understand that. And he's gone again. Well, this isn't looking too good. At least it's on the green. Yeah, baby. <laughs> I'm willing to take any motherfucking advantage. Because... And about 16 feet left to go. This is stroke five, so I'm already in bogey territory. So I might as well putt it. And... Oh my gracious, that was close. And this one for the double. And now let's take a look at the leaderboard. Do you have to? And currently sitting at 11 over par for the day. I don't think we should take a look at the leaderboard. And the 13th hole. Oh, 13. That's my lucky number. <laughs> what a freaking disaster. Seriously. I need to practice some more. Oh, now, 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 now you slice, hook, hook. Hook again. Oh. Very slow, which is a slice. Slow, which is another slice. How do you stop from going very slow? There we go. An actual shot. It's looking like it's heading into the fairway. Not bad. Not fantastic. A little bit short on the okay, white stroke. From 125 yards out. 112 meters in Australian talk. Two meters up too, so yeah, that that's good. We'll leave it there. Take another practice.
Not. Here is the pitching wedge. In the hole. And this one's for Birdie. Oh, I thought that was going to go. And they're about three feet away here. You know the kind of game that just absolutely annoys the shit out of you? And a nice... Time. This is it. This is what I love about this game. And after that one, I love this game because it annoys the shit out of you. I must admit, I do love sports games. Hole. Because every time you play the stupid damn thing, there is a change. Either you're in a different f course, the wind has changed, different direction, changes the feel of the game again. Um, your handicap is improved, so you're hitting it harder or better, or something like that. Uh, so, all those little tiny in, uh, intricacies change the game every time you play it. It's not like Pac-Man where if you know the pattern for Pac-Man, you just do the same pattern over and over and over again. And somehow it will get you where you want to go. That's probably a better shot for this one, because it is a downhill shot. It is downhill, so let's see if we. This one's looking good, folks. Get that in the hole. And this one's for Birdie. Hello, Birdie. Birdie, num num. Don't fuck it up, Ashy. I didn't fuck it up. I didn't fuck it up. Ten over Hoorah! Par after that hole. Ten over par. Hoorah! <laughs> it's rather embarrassing. Ten over. And setting up now on the 15th <laughs> tee. Shit, man. Ten over par. I mean, what's that even mean? This is definitely a hybrid shot. It's not going to be much use of anything else. What's, what's the point? Just stick with a hybrid. Because the hybrid swings a bit like an iron. So less chance of it. And I'm not quite doing sure where this one's going to end up. A screw up, but look, I've done a screw up with it. Okay, 79 meters. Straight up. Going with the 8 iron here. Eight, eight so iron. A bit long, folks. Eight iron. Poor approach it, shot there. It wasn't long. Too much club. It wasn't long, Junior. It was wrong friggin' direction. Nine meter carry with the club, and that's the lowest I can get with the chip. So that's nine meters. And to save par. Oh my, this is looking very, very promising. And that one will drop for par. And in today's event, thus far, the score to beat is even par. And now teeing off on the par five. I don't know if these, like I said, I don't think they are real people. I wish they were real people in their scores, 
and that way you get, you get an idea of how bad your score was. But of course, if their score is fantastic, then that's the last thing you want to hear about. And again, I like to hook, Ooh, hook it. The fairway here. I like to hook it, hook it. I like to hook it, hook it. Look at that. Well, I apologize, folks. I did not see that going into the rough. Yeah, that's because you're an idiot. It was obvious to everyone it was going into the rough. I have to go up a club. Might have gone up at one a bit okay, up. Okay, hitting this par five in two is going to set up some definite eagle possibilities. Eagle, as in the eagles. No, it's turning too much. Turning too much. Ooh. Turning too much. This one's right around eight feet. And that'll drop for birdie. Yum yum. And after that one, currently sitting at nine over par for the day. And next up is a par four, folks. Still pretty much a disaster. Too fast, and this we're hooking. Close winning. Could be in the fairway. Could be in the water. Oh. Hey, you gotta carry that weight. Carry that weight a long time. Yeah, hey, you gotta carry that water. Carry that water a long time. 26 meters off 135 isn't going to do nothing. Uh, 15, 30 meters off that is 110. I'll have to get the next one up. I like to do it, do it. I like to do it, do it. I like to do it, do it. I like to do it, do it, do it to do the left and do it to the right and put it in the hole, which will get me right a height. I like I to do it, do that. it. And about eight feet to the cup. Eight feet to the cup. Which is still a very long distance if you putt like shit. For the bird. And he's moving on up on the leaderboard after that hole. Moving on yeah, up. Like I'm that. moving on and out. He tees off here on the final hole. Gotta wonder what's going through his head. He's seven strokes off the lead. I'm wondering if I can kill the commentator. Will they allow me to kill the commentator and get away with it? That's what I'm wondering. What are you wondering? I wonder how many times you've been had, and I wonder how many things have gone bad, and I wonder, wonder I do. Okay, this one's looking pretty good. Which means it's crap. Whenever he says something looks good, my heart sinks. From about 135 yards out. Pretty flat. Pretty flat. 
Well, I wonder how many times you've been had, and I wonder how many things have gone bad, and I wonder. With a pitching wedge here. I wonder. Wonder I do. And I think he will be happy with that. And sinking this next putt will result in a final round score of 78. Yay! 78! Oh, how exciting! That's like your president. 76, whatever the fuck his name is. Shit! So close. And they'll uh, tap it in and end the round with a par. And as his event comes to an end, not a whole lot to write home about, Luke. I don't feel like he had that competitive edge that, that you really need oh, to shut up. in the leaderboard. Just all of well, you, shut judge, up. John, but they certainly didn't deliver their best performance today. Just, just On shut up. Of John McCarthy, I'm Luke Elby. Look forward to your company next time. Let's rate the course, eh? Uh, three. Nah, it's a good course. I should have rated it a bit more than that. I'm just jealous that I fucked up. I got to go again because, well, I have to. Hello and welcome to our coverage of the Sand Dune Classic. My name is Luke Elvey, and with me is John McCarthy. Hello, Luke. What's Hello, up? John. Well, John, there's a great atmosphere here today. The crowd sounds like they're up for it, and I'm looking forward to seeing some fantastic golf. The crowd Thank sound you. like Talk they're up for it. What the fuck does that even mean? There we go, get those first drive nerves out of the system. Should be interesting. Yeah, he's probably not uh, happy about that shot. What the f fuck happened there? Anyone know? I got the balls to tell me. Hookity, hookity, hardy, hardy, hookity, hookity, hardy, hardy. That one's back in the fairway. Five meters up. I'm only halfway up the stairs, not up or down. I'm only halfway up the stairs since you've been around.
looks like a seven uh, only half I think this might be a bit long a bit and nothing to write home about on that approach shot too much club I think do you now do ya do ya do ya do you think it was too much club well do ya do ya do ya Do you think it was too much club? Well, do ya, do ya, do ya? Do you think it was too much club? Two Stupid two commentator. Do, 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 do. This game is driving me insane. And finishing this hole out with a solid putt. Not that and I've been insane day, before. Over this is game is driving me insane here. Off on this par four. Par four. Par four with the iron, the iron. He's gonna hit the iron. <laughs> We're gonna hit an iron. <laughs> yeah, how the hardies. <laughs> Am I making fun of you, Yankee Banky? Oh, boo hoo. I make fun of Yankee. Oh. You can make fun of my drive. Where's the wind? Where's the wind? You got five kilometer wind. There you go. And I think he will be pleased with that. Yeah, it's called luck. Five yards to the pin. It's called luck, baby. But there was a five, nine kilometer wind. See, it says a nine kilometer wind. It's a fart. It's a fart. There's a farting in the air. Do, 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 do. Farting in the air. Do, 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 do. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Farting in the air. I think you'll like that. Except and for the hook. For the birdie. You think I'll like that too? Hmm? Huh? Sounds like some kind of sexual innuendo to me. Ooh, almost, almost. And for the par. I talked about almost yesterday, so. I'll just briefly touch upon it. Almost means and that no. Drops. Yeah. And as we look at the leaderboard, uh, current leader. I almost became a billionaire. No. I almost married. Getting ready to tee off. Uh, part three. A very sexy lady from Hollywood, which means no. You know, almost no. So why didn't you say, why didn't you just say, no? So you Aussie put you out of your misery and say, nah. Not to that. Not to that. And I'll probably hook it. And this, this time I'll slice it, of course. Chances are... Chances are I hit it straight. And this putt is for Birdie. Hello, Birdie! It's a couple of declines there. Oh, that's not even. It's going uphill, dude. It's going uphill. It's about eight feet. Still going uphill, see? Uphill. Uphill, you gotta hit it. Oh, that was so, so close. No, I don't have turrets in zone. Like I just like up. to beat the shit out of myself. <sighs> and as we look at the leaderboard, our no. leader is currently at one under par. Now the fourth hole.
fourth hole. What does that even mean? Anyone know? It's the hole that's fourth in line. Very good, very clever. Press the wrong button. There we go. Do that, do that, do that to me one more time. Well, that was quite a display of power there. Yeah, yeah. I like to display my power. I like to display my power. This will be exterminated. 264 meters. And Exterminate. About 235 yards to go. Par 5, isn't it? Oh, yeah, it is. I basically need to just get on the green. Do that. Do that. Do that. Bounce onto the green. Thing. Do that, do that, do that. Bounce into the and green the thing. Luck on that approach shot. Do that, do that, club. do that, do that. You're driving me crazy, baby. Do, 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 do that, do that, do that, do that, do that. Do that to the and green thing. Feet to the cup. Mmm, cup. Ooh, that looked good. I'm gonna pull my eye out in front of camera. Are you ready? Car. Here we go. Oh. And he is moving up on the leaderboard after that hole. Yeah. And now setting up no. for the par four tee off. Tee off. We're off to tee off the wizard, the wonderful tee off the wizard, the thingy, Bobby. Hybrid. Stay with the hybrid. Stay with your hybrid, baby. Well, this one's looking like it's in the fairway. I didn't check the wind. He could have gone into the sand. And about a buck fifteen to the pin from here. Buck fifteen. What kind of talk is that, American? You don't know what you're talking about, American. You got a nine kilometer wind blowing against you, right? So you need to get oh you're right, hey, it is a buck fifteen. Okay. You meant a buck fifteen meters. Now I understand. Taking a shot with the pitching okay. wedge. Looks like the pitching wedge was a bit too much club on this one. And uh, on this shot, he's ended up in the water. He's going to have to re-hit or take a drop. Oh, that just shit. It went over. It went over the green. Damn you. From 115 yards out. Two meter drop. So the wind is crap. Wind is crap. Doesn't do shit. Oh, now I'm slicing. Slicing and dicing. Dance floor. 
Oh, this game just makes you want to poke your eye out. And it's atrocious, really. Do that, do that, do and that. Six feet away. Do that to your eyes. Yeah, do that, do that, do Ooh, that. That's uh, that's bad luck there. What? Looking like eight feet to the cup here. What the fuck just happened? And a decent putt. Did I skim the the ball over the friggin' hole? Today's event, the score to beat is one under currently. And moving on to the sixth here. I skimmed the ball over the motherfucking hole. Shit, man. This, this is a game of nightmares. I mean, I played some horror movies and horror games before, but this one, this one is the most horrible horror game I've ever played. It doesn't get any more horrible yeah, this than this game. Fairway. This game will scare you to death. From 125 yards out. Think of the most horrible game, horror movie game that you ever played. Multiply by 27. And this is this game. This game is... Horror incarnate. Horror incarnate, I'm telling you. Oh, hooky here, yeah, hooky, it looks hooky. Like wedge it's just a bit too much here. It isn't too much, it's hook. It's hook, you dumb fuck. And ladies and gentlemen, that was a, that was a poor approach. Too much club on that, I think. Stop saying too much club. You don't know what you're talking about. That was too much club. All right, 27 feet to the cup. I've skimmed it again. Ooh, and just, just inches away. Inches away. And this for the bogey. Inches. I. And unfortunately, he's going to move down in the standings after that one. I don't want to know about it. Off on this par four. That's the only thing I really wanted to know what kind of par it was. Why you got me down there, man? Well, you got, got me in just that much trouble. I suppose the wind. The wind, the wind. If you get it in the wind. Here we go, seven kilometer wind. Seven kilometer wind on our side. Well, so far so good for this one. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Look at that. I cleared I cleared the hurdle. And this is a par four you say. Okay, and from hundred and fifty yards out. A par four you say, eh? You don't say. You don't say. You don't say. What do you say? You didn't say. No, go, going with the hook. And he will like that. And this one's for Birdie. <laughs> Apparently, a 15 meter putt is something I like. Because, you know, I can get those all the time. They're, they're my bread and butter putts. Junior. Fuck. 
setting up about 12 feet away. Where I will blow my brains out in a cup. Of your choice, there's another one. Far out! Five feet to go here. You say five feet, and I say fuck feet. And that drops for bogey. Oh, I'm gonna need it. As we look at the leaderboard, our current leader today is sitting at one under. That's the score to beat. And setting up for the par five hole. I'm gonna need something to like really calm me down afterwards. I picked the wrong day to give up smoking. I picked the wrong day to give up alcohol. I picked the wrong day to give up whatever. This one's looking pretty good so far. Whoa, boy. Whoa. Whoa. And in actual fact, that shot ended up in the rough. When he says, this shot looks pretty good so far, you're pretty much guaranteed that you fucked it. It's pretty much in the bag that you've screwed it up. Pretty much in the bag. And he's probably not too happy about that one. Let's see how this next shot goes out of the rough. You're supposed to give me advice. I used to give advice in the other games. I just... I just don't know what to do with myself! I don't know what to do with myself! I'm going crazy! Internalizing all the bad shots! Hazy! Toss up, let's see where this one will land. Oh, for fuck's sake. I didn't read the distance, did I? Nope. You did not. 13 meters, 13 meters. Oh my. Well, that chip ricochets off the pin. And 13 feet to go here. Ooh, and that was, uh, that was very close. And this putt is for double bogey. Gee, thanks for that. Ooh, 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 ooh. That was, uh, that was very close. And hopefully, this putt goes for the triple. And that hole has led to uh, him falling down on the leaderboard here. And just about to uh, tee off on this par three. I just don't know what to do. I don't know what to do with myself. I just don't know what to do with myself. Baby, it's easy when you swing like a piece of shit. And you hit and this one's looking pretty good. Nothing in front of it. I still don't know what to do. Alright, and he's on the green. It's about a ten footer from here. And that one'll drop for birdie. 
And as we check back in with Luke after the front nine, uh, what are you seeing out there today, Luke? He's the leader is sitting at one under for the event, John. Thanks, Luke. We'll see you again at the end of the round. I just don't know what to do with myself. I just don't know what to do with myself. Baby, it's not easy. Oh, look at the slice there, baby. And this is heading directly at the water hazard. Come get a slice of pie. Come get a slice of pie, honey, John. And again. And water hazard incoming, folks. For fuck's sake. What is going on here? Oh, now. Now. Now you hit it right. Oh, now you hook. So after two Ooh, slices, not too sure about this one. <laughs> you're gonna hit me a hook. <laughs> this game hates me. This is a black thing. I'm sure of it. I am sure this is a black thing. Pleased with that, and this lie is is currently in the rough. Oh fuck off! Seriously, just absolutely fuck off. feet to go here. Run, run, run away! Oh, my land. That was uh, that was very close. I wish you would stop saying it was very close when it was not. Setting up 12 feet away from the cup. When it was not very close, it's probably a good idea to not say it was close. Oh my goodness, close. Very close. It's, it keeps saying it, it keeps saying it. This looks like around a four footer, I'd say. I'm gonna throttle it. And a good pot. I'm gonna throttle him. And 15 over par after that one. Fifteen. And now setting up for the next par four hole. Fifteen over par. <laughs> Fifteen over motherfucking par. Seriously. He's got to be pleased with that. And from 160 yards out. And here's an eight iron. And this one is on the green with a lengthy putt ahead. Oh, 
Oh my goodness, that was close. And for the par. And a nice putt there. I am no literally standing uh, after that hole. I am literally pulling out my eyeballs and feasting on them. And moving along now on the twelfth hole. Literally. Not you know, not metaphorically or anything. I am literally cutting out my motherfucking eyeballs and eating them. Going with the eight iron here. Eight iron. The yeah, iron the irony the here, ladies and gentlemen. It's not overshot. That's hooked. Well, that's no good uh, as far as approaches go. Too much club on that one. I'll give you too much club, motherfucker. That's too much club. Yeah. The slight applause of and it's about a few feet from the top <sighs> couldn't be bothered and as we look at the leaderboard our current leader sits at one under Right, let's see what uh, happens on the 13th hole here. More of the disastrous same old has to guess. Oh, look at that. More of the disastrous same. Bounce the other way. No, no, he has to go into the rough. And I doubt he's very happy about that shot. <sighs> Could have gone the other way. Nah. No such thing as going the other way. Not for you. Not for you. Well, that shot's looking not too good. <sighs> Thanks. Oh, the frustration of this game, it's just annoying the bejesus out of me. Absolute bejesus. And this putt to save par. Yeah. Nice little putt. 16 over par after that hole. And setting up now on the 14th hole. And nothing wrong with that shot. And about 180 yards to the pin.
that looks like the hybrid. And this is looking a bit long, I think. Unlucky on that approach shot. A bit too much club on that one. This putt's about 13 feet from the cup. Ooh, and that was very, very close. This putt is for the bogey. And finishing the hole with a solid putt. And our leader today, sitting up uh, the top of the board here at two under par. And moving on to the 15th here. Maybe if I get four eagles. And nothing wrong with that shot from 140 yards out. Going with the nine iron here. Still going in an iron. Well, not a good approach iron. Out there. It's an iron. Unfortunately, not enough club on that one. Fourteen feet away. Oh, I thought that one was going to be in. This one looks about uh, four feet. I don't know. And the putt will drop. All I know is I've had enough. And after that hole, he will stay right where he is on the leaderboard. And setting up on the 16th tee. Looking good. And this putt's for birdie. And that putt will drop. And sitting at 18 over for the day after that one. And let's see what the 17th has in store. Which tells me I was 19 over before I hit that birdie. Seriously. Well, this one's looking pretty good.
When he says that, there's trouble coming. From 145 yards out. This shot might be a bit long. Oh, the iron, iron, or iron. You gotta be happy with that. And this putt's for birdie. And right into the cup. And as we look at the board here, score to beat today, and this event is two under. And picking up on the 18th hole action here, let's see what happens. I know what happens. That's why I'm not excited. I know what happens. I fuck it up again. Phenomenal power on that one. Too much power, maybe? And about 215 yards out from here. The three wood with a slight hook, you know, for a little bit of discomfort. Now it's an unfortunate approach shot, bit too much club on that. Seven feet to the cup. Ooh. I'm never going to play this game again. And about four feet from the cup. Solid putt. And Luke, as his event comes to an end, don't know really what else to say, uh, but he just wasn't there. And he wasn't on when he needed to be today. Well, John, I know they won't be happy with that performance, but if they've learnt the lesson from it, well, they're still gained. That's a positive. Oh, for fuck's sake. On behalf of John McCarthy. Just fuck off. Seriously, just... I want to be alone. <coughs> well, that was a disaster, ladies and gentlemen, so thank you for bearing with me, but this, this is a really frustrating game. Bye now.